Okay, in this problem, we're told to determine the solution to the equation y double prime plus 9y equals 0 with the initial conditions y of 0 equals 1 and y prime of 0 equals negative 1. So we can quick determine the characteristic equation. That's just r squared plus 9 equals 0. Solve for r. We see that r is equal to plus or minus 3i. And then we know that the general solution to this equation is then y of x is equal to e to the real part of this complex roots, which is 0, x times cosine of 3 x plus sine of 3 x. So e to the 0 is just 1. So we can, oh, and that should be c1 cosine 3 x and c2 sine of 3 x. So we see that our general solution is c1 cosine 3 x plus c2 sine of 3 x. And we want to find c1 and c2 with our given initial conditions. So we know that y of 0 is equal to 1. So we can plug in 0 for x. Cosine of 0 is 1. Sine of 0 is 0. So the second term is 0. And we see that C1 is equal to 1. And so we can, we'll write that up here. Now our second initial condition is that the derivative at 0 is equal to negative 1. So we can quick take the derivative of our general solution. And we get that y prime of x is equal to negative 3c1 sine of 3x plus 3c2 cosine 3x. We know that c1 is 1, so we can just leave this as a negative 3 times sine of 3x. If we plug in for x equals 0, we get sine of 0 is 0, so this first term is 0. Cosine of 0 is 1, so we get negative 1. Our initial condition is equal to 3c2. And solving for c2, we see that c2 is equal to negative 1 third. So now we're just going to plug in our constant c1 and c2 into our general solution, and we get our solution. So we see that our solution is cosine of 3x minus one-third sine of 3x. 